Greetings and salutations, fellow scholars of the self-taught. I want to introduce you to perhaps one of the greatest and single most awesome set of books ever published and put onto the market. And this set of books is... The Great Books of the Western World. A 54 or 60 volume set of works, depending on which edition you have. And within these volumes are the greatest books of the Western world. Books which have stood the corrosive tests of time. Books which have endured criticism, the clergy, iconoclasts, fires, wars, and are still, still accessible to us today. Books which have influenced, without opposition, the world we know, past, present, and future. Books which have indubitably shaped and molded our culture. This includes everything from the epics of Homer, the philosophies of Plato, the scientific works of Newton, the sonnets of Shakespeare, the histories of Gibbon, and yes, even the pedophile works of Freud. If you happen to be starting your own book collection, this is a wonderful set to start with. It's got just about all the foundational stuff you could possibly want, and then some. I mean, where else are you gonna find the Sand Reckoner by Archimedes? Never before have I seen that, single or in a set, other than the great books of the Western world. Anywho, this set was created by two of my favorite philosophers, Robert Maynard Hutchins and Mortimer Adler. And they created this set not with the intention of it looking pretty on a bookshelf, but with people actually reading it. Normal people with a normal education reading it, not some Ivy League scholar your everyday blue-collar citizen. So that's what I'm gonna do, and that's what I challenge you to do. Read through the entirety of the great books of the Western world. Give yourself the ultimate self-taught liberal education. Teach yourself the marvelous things you were never introduced to in school. In the great book set, there is a proposed 10-year reading plan. I will not be using this in my challenge because it does not include every work that's in this set. Rather, I will be reading this set almost chronologically to see how one work built upon another, how one idea uh, was influenced by the former in order to create the magnificent ideas which we have today. I have no specific time frame for us to accomplish this goal. Go at your own pace. As for me, I'm aiming for about five years. That sounds reasonable to my reading habits. As I read through each of the 500 works in the set, I will be posting a video review of each, stating my opinions, as well as linking the book back to what Robert Maynard Hutchins calls the Great Conversation. The, the analysis of these works and seeing how they all influenced each other and what sort of things spawn from their greatness whether it be good or bad. So as you read through these books, I encourage you to write your own reviews. And if you do, I will link those in the video description. And if not, to at least continue the discussion of that work in the comment section of that video review. Feel free to bring up whatever topic of that work you like in the comment section, however vulgar, however obscene, however uh, spoiling it might be. In the comment section, anything goes. So feel free to talk about whatever you want about that work. Let's make this like a YouTube book club, shall we? Talk. Let's have some fun here. Let's have some discussion, some back and forth. After all, does that not reinforce our uh, knowledge of these works more so than reading it? Discussing it? And you don't need to have the same pace as me, nor do you need to start at the same time. You can take however long you need. The thing about the great books is that they're meant to be a lifelong quest for knowledge. So even once we've completed these books, there will be many more great books to read. Perhaps when we have completed this set many years down the line, I will issue yet another challenge to read through the books in the 100-page bibliography of Volume 3. <laughs> but that's for the future. Anyways, the purpose of this challenge is simply to complete the great books of the Western world, not to see how fast you can read through it all. And uh, not to mention, all of these works are public domain, so if you don't have this set, you can still read them for free. So here's a link where you can find a list of all of the works in this set, as well as free public domain copies for you to read. And if you're ever wondering which book in the set I'm reading or which book I'm going to read next, always come back to this video and look in the description where you can find my current status, so that you can follow along if you like. So, the Great Books Challenge. So be sure to subscribe to my channel, The Long Haired Freaky Dude, and get video reviews of these books as we read through them. If you want to see videos pertaining only to the Great Books Challenge, then check out the Great Books Challenge playlist. So now, I leave you to read. Read your hearts out. And talk about what you've read. Share your newly acquired knowledge with all of us. So I leave you now 
Enjoy, my friends. Enjoy.